My brother said, go down. See how you guys went down. So you have to understand that. Try to use arms. Every time you go down, so be ready. So relax yourself. Don't use arms too much. You'll see later when you fight from the ground, you can't too much put the arms like that. So what I want you to do, so tense up your fist a little bit. You can put your arms like this, you can put comfortable, it's up to you. So now, on your own, what I want you to do, I want you to inhale, you tense up legs. When you exhale, you exhale this tension, you put it towards your fist. Okay, so it's like you learn how to spread tension. It could be a hit, it could be injury, but everything else has to be relaxed. No shoulders, just a little bit of tension in your fist. So this is gonna later on, we're gonna put this into when people grab you, when people hit you. You take this power, you put it in your fist, you give it back. Remember, don't go open your fist right now. Just keep them naturally closed. Keep fist tense. Now stomach. So keep your fist closed, inhale, tense up stomach, you exhale this tension towards fist. So again, this is like a strike to the stomach. Tension comes, you spread this. Okay, now chest and back. So you tense up your chest and back, you inhale, chest and back, exhale towards fist. Okay, now guys, now whole body. So you inhale, you tense the whole body, exhale towards hands. But when you exhale, relax the whole body, try to relax deep and try to feel the fist. And guys, study this too now. Every once in a while, you keep your fist like your ass. Remember too, if you make a fist, if you do too much, again, everyone make it to the squeeze your fist tight. See, look, a little tension goes up, right? That's, that's no good. It should be just a little bit of tension in the fist, but the muscles like very soft. So when you start to move on the ground every once in a while, tense up one fist, tense up both fists, and you feel tension somewhere, you grab this tension, and you send it to your fist. So it's like you fight, you run a fear comes or a hit, you grab, and you all constantly put power in your fist. People ask me, why don't you guys tense up your fist very tense, right? One reason is the blood starts to move from the, from the fist. If it's overly tense, the blood starts to go away. So when blood's there, it's like a, it's a nice shield kind of for, for like safety. It's more, you won't break it. Picture like a stick, right? You, you break it, ask him, you broke this whole hand. Overly tense. So that's why, one reason, blood goes away and, and there's no safety there. When your body is like healthy, the whole body should be like that. Everyone saw one fist, both fists. You grab any tension, you inhale, exhale towards fist. Start to go down. Okay, guys, so one thing, why, why I said before, right? When you go start to go down like this. So when, when you start to move free now, start to pay attention to hands. Because this is when you start to strike, when you start to move, you start to position the body where you can answer. So if you're always like this, there's no way you can, you can, but elbows come. But try to understand, put yourself in positions where you get up, see, bam, you can hit, you can protect, and the fists are always ready to, to, to do something. So now start to pay attention to the fists more. But move free. You should be able to hit anywhere, boom, with power. Natural movements, less tension, less muscles, proper breathing, more air, more power. 